Hi, hola, welcome again to my channel where I share my passion of art with all of you by making videos of art projects that I do right here in my art studio. If you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Laura and I am a graphic designer living here in Houston, Texas. Remember the old cartoons way back then? Really, back then. Some of you haven't even been born yet. But the cartoons were two-dimensional, just one flat color. They didn't have the technology like we have today to give them form dimension, make them 3D, even 4D. So this is why I chose two different mediums, Prismacolors and oils. And I use them both to give this character some dimension and form. Both mediums require different techniques. Prismacolors with the burnishing and layering of colors and oils with blending as well with your brushes, glazing and adding color over color. So watch the video and see you at the end. Colored pencils were invented in Germany by Faber-Castell around 1908. There were only 60 colors. Colored pencils in that time were first used for checking and correction. Today, colored pencils are capable of rendering art styles that are expressive and abstract to detailed and photorealistic. They are slow to use compared to wet media like paint, but when it comes to control and detail, Color pencils are unparalleled. Artists have been using oil paints for many years. 
In fact, oil paints were first used in Asia around the 7th century. Oil-based paints were introduced into Europe around the 12th century. In those times, they were used mainly for decorations. By the 15th century, they were finally adopted as an artistic medium. Oil paints are very flexible and rich in color. They can be applied as glazes diluted with turpentine or as dense thick impasto. Oil paints are slow to dry, so an artist can continue working the paint for much longer than other types of art mediums. It is also easy to make corrections during the process of painting. Once again, thank you for following this time-lapse video of this week's project. Hope you enjoyed it and learned a little bit more about these two mediums. Don't forget to press the subscribe button down below, like the video, and if you would like to leave a comment, you are more than welcome to do so. I will see you again on the next video of the next art project. Until then, peace and love. Adios.